directly come dancing star Tony Adams has apologized to his professional dance partner Katya Jones after dropping her during rehearsals for their movie week performance this weekend. The 55-year-old Arsenal star also made reference to the football incident which saw him drop his teammate Steve Morrow, 52, and break his arm. Tony managed to drop Katya in spectacular fashion during rehearsals as the pair put the work in to rise from the bottom of the leaderboard after they were saved from the dance-off by the public vote. Taking to Twitter, the football manager posted a series of snaps of his and Katya's jolly Charleston for the second week of the competition. He penned, that was a little bit better, but a lot more fun. Thanks to everyone who voted for me, I'm trying my hardest to get it right, but at times I revert to type. Scroll to see my Stevie Morrow moment in training, he added, tweeting a clip from rehearsals. Above the video, he issued an apology, writing, Sorry Katya, and Steve. Still sorry after all these years, in the clip. Tony can be seen holding Katyan on one shoulder before losing his balance and swinging her into a dustbin. Katya lay out stretched on the floor for a moment, before springing back up and brushing it off like a pro. During the video, a red arrow could also be seen pointing to Katya that reads Steve Morrow, in reference to his dramatic dropping of his teammate following the 1993 League Cup final. Steve had been the hero of the hour after scoring the winning goal at Wembley, but after the final whistle blew, Tony made a blunder in his attempts to celebrate the win, injuring his teammate in the process. The team captain attempted to lift the midfielder onto his shoulders, but dropped him from the height onto the turf. As a result, Steve broke his arm and was rushed to hospital, while his teammates climbed the Wembley steps to accept the cup. Steve recovered and received a winner's medal ahead of the FA Cup final a month later, 